Yeah, I'm kind of hungry. Okay, where should we go? Um, go to that Mexican place. Okay, which one though? That Mexican place. Let's get it. Can I get one California burrito, please? Un California burrito? Yes, please. Pico de gallo? Yes, everything. Yeah. Prefiero to go. To go. Okay. No, es que cuando pasa algo, un accidente o algo, ya están los de, los de la televisión grabando. Ah, Pero sí. Pero que, que, ah, no, de verdad. All together, $8.69. So a pretty average price, not too expensive, not at all. Keep in mind, there was a 50 cents charge if you use a car, but that's whatever, I can deal with that. Dining area. What's your first impression of this place? So it's nice. The lady was nice, the one that um, ordered for us and everything. So I like. I like. Look at all the lights. I like the. That's a pretty big burrito. That's pretty big. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you. Really nice service, you know? I really appreciate that. Let's That's probably like the best service. Okay. Best service, yeah. Let's get back to the lab, shall we? And we're back. Herman, what did you think about the place? The benches were nice. The customer service was really nice. I like the lady. It was really well lit. Too. I had, yeah, it was yeah. really, I just like, the whole experience was really nice. I liked it a lot. Yeah. Probably actually one of the best experiences you had. Yeah. The music was like, just a little bit loud. So you might have to kind of, you know, be a little loud when talking to people, but, um. Is that eight, is it 69? 869, okay, that's not too. It is 50 cents, if, 50 cents plus charge if you want to use card. So, but even with that, it's not that bad. Yeah, it's not, it's not that bad. What is it? Sally Elitas, they had a plus charge, and that was like 1050. Yeah. By popular demand, people have been asking, Luke, can you see the heat of it? So just this one time for one very special teacher, I have a thermometer. That's a C. But almost like, it is like, it's like 110 degrees. Fahrenheit in there. Wow. Oh, whoa! I did not even notice that. Here, we'll show them. Here, let's get. Here, let me first do the. Uh, that's a nice weighing and measuring. Yeah. Yeah, 1.8 pounds. That's a big burrito. I'd be honest with you. I'm pretty sure we messed up last time with the cellulite. Because when something happened, that was a huge yeah. burrito. That was like seriously. The, that's the biggest one we had. But 1.8. That's actually that's really big. It's almost two yeah. pounds. So I'm gonna go ahead with the measuring. It's like. It's like nine inches. It is very kind of divided, you can see. Like right there. So we'll have to mix it around a bit. But one thing, what are you, um, what are you seeing, Herman, actually? Um, so it is very loaded. Half is like fries, pico, cheese, and the other half is like meat. Show them the tortilla, that is a beautiful, yeah. that is such a nice tortilla right there. That's like the best looking one we've had. Yeah, it's really like nice and cooked. It, I feel like it probably won't be like very chewy. You ready? Cheers, cheers, man. Here we go. Boom. So, uh, what are you getting here? I feel like it could use like more stuff. Maybe, maybe some like some guac. Maybe a little bit of sour cream, mostly like guac though. Is this the first burrito we've had that doesn't have like sour cream or guac in it? No, which one didn't have any? The non-special one for oh yeah didn't. And then um, burritos and fries didn't have guac, but it did have sour cream. Okay. So um, so this one's a little dry. Yeah, it is a little bit dry. It does have a nice flavor though, like. 
You can really taste that pico. Yeah. In my opinion. The meat has like this little thing of spice though. I don't know if you caught that. Like it has a little yeah. kick to it, which is nice. Um, for, I know people say that you can just like, the thing is it is truly like, just pretty like cut in half there. Like fries on one side, me on the other. So it's just a very simple plain burrito. Um, the meat is well seasoned, so it does pretty, taste pretty nice. So that gives it a little bit of a kick. Other than that, it's just kind of like pretty average, kind of nice. Could add a few things to really put it to that next level. I think like it is true though. It's like because the customer service is great. I love the customer service. Yeah, like, I definitely nice. like if you can like eat there. It seems like a really fun place to eat. Would you recommend this place though? That's the thing. Uh, I would. I would probably go there. Yeah. I agree. I actually. I think it's a. I know it is true. It's like it's just if you if they just added sour cream into it, I think the burrito would easily yeah. like go up. Um, but if you plan on actually sitting down in a place, I totally would recommend this place. This is it has a cool vibe to it. I'm just gonna do an outro. Should I just do the outro? Yeah, do the outro in a British accent. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> That's terrible, man. Bye, you guys.